I'm unclear as, oh. What? What's going on guys? So we found a really cool place with some really cool homes and I think you're gonna like it. So let's go ahead and get into it. Check this out. The fanciest, the coolest, the best modular home we've seen so far. This is it. At least this maker, this manufacturer is. This is Cozy Cabins. And this right here is the Frontier, all brand new for 2021. And it is a two bedroom, two bath, 1400 square foot. Now we are, like I said, up at Cozy Cabins and we've toured this home, which is huge and gorgeous. And we've toured this home, which all three will be on the channel. So. With that being said, if y'all enjoy this video, please make sure you hit that like button. It really helps out the video. And without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, but before we do, let's look at this porch. <laughs> and then at the end of the video, I'm gonna take you around also and show you the home as we discuss prices. I'll give you both the base price and the tour price as you've seen it today. Not only does this home just look cool, it has some really, high-end features this isn't something that they just kind of slapped together they really put some effort into these homes and you're about to see why wow right that's all you can say when you first walk into this home it's just the pine that just beautiful so let me go ahead and turn you around and let you see the entrance so this is when you first come through the door and you also have a coat closet with adjustable shelving, which is super nice. You can fit that to whatever you wanted, whatever height that you needed. And then actually, they got some really cool stools in here. I don't know why they're not, they're not put out. But anyway, all right. And then you can see the floors right here. These are actually plank floors. They're not the vinyl that we're used to, which is really nice. So at the end of the video, I'm gonna let you know the base price and the actual price of the home that we just toured is. So if you're interested, definitely stay tuned for that. And uh, I think, I think you're gonna be surprised. Definitely one of the higher end homemakers uh, that we've seen so far. And let me know, it, have you heard of Cozy Homes before? Uh, if you have, I wanna know about it. We actually just happened to stumble upon them. The slow close draw drawers. Um, we're, we were coming up here to look at some skylines uh, at a different location. And uh, Jen found these guys. And we're like, oh, cool, let's go check them out. So here we are. Jen actually just got done uh, touring that bigger home that you saw, uh, which is really nice. Holy cow. It's got a little loft up there, too. Um, but this has got the little tray sliders within the, the cabinets, which is really nice, and everything is. That slow close, soft close, uh, whatever you would like to call it. What is that? It's a microwave. Ah. Look at it. It's got the panel here. And then... I'm unclear as... So. Oh. What? Oh. <laughs> and then they went with a gray uh, in here, which is really nice. Got a dishwasher. I think the gray, the gray cabinets goes really nice with the, the countertops. And then here you got that inset sink, which is really nice. Just a beautiful home. And then even in here, again, you have all these so let me know what you think about those. Those are something that's a little bit different. We haven't really seen them before. And your little corner cabinet. 
And then this thing, I'm not really sure what it's for. It looks like you can just, it's a, a hidey hole. It's got a little plug back there. Maybe you can like put your coffee pot and stuff in there until you need it. You got the gas stove, the beautiful stainless range hood. All right, so that's the kitchen. Let me know what you think. And then your little dining space. Right next to these very nice sliding glass doors. Then your electric heating stove. Oh, gas. Gas heating stove. Ooh, ooh. Very nice. Log cabins are like, I'm a mountain kind of guy. I'm a mountain man. <laughs> um, and I just like, I love the mountains. I actually spent, little known fact, uh, I lived in Steamboat. When I turned like 21, I moved out to Steamboat Springs, Colorado. And that was kind of like my first experience on my own. And I actually stayed there uh, for about five years. So I really, really love the mountains. So enough about that. Let's go ahead and head on back and check out the rest of this home. All right, so this is your first bathroom. Very big and spacious. And then the closet, just a linen closet in the bathroom which is nice. I like how they really divided up the toilet and sink uh, with this closet. I think that's neat. And these are also adjustable, which is cool. So you can easily fix the height of those, which is nice because I, I stack my towels up, you know what I mean? And like, sometimes it's just, you need more room and I'd prefer not to put them up on another shelf, but I have to, which then limits space for me putting other things, so. And then that is your shower tub combo. Nice little window. All right. Then across the hall, we enter our utility room. I like this. Nothing in between. I can do my laundry over here. I can wash things. I can fold things. Not having to go real far in between, traveling around everywhere, trying to get to, to what I want. And one of those inset doors, little hidey door into this closet. Very nice way that they have hidden their electric panel. Again, the Heidi door coming into the to the room. Then you have a hall closet. Very spacious. Now I'm not sure. I would imagine that they would finish this out. I don't know, because other than that, you're just gonna be putting all of your stuff. I guess, is that an under? Oh yeah. That's just the, the moisture barrier under the house. So maybe, you know what this is probably for? You set this on, if you set it on a foundation or something like that, then you have, it's not even, um, what am I trying to say? It's not even a closet. That would be access to your basement under the house. Um, so it's set up for stairs right now. That's why that is the way it is. 
Uh, I actually saw that in the other home too, and I was like, well, that's weird. But that makes sense. All right, so this is your first bedroom. Over here you have access to your attic. Really cool beds. I like these. Definitely gives to that um, mountain feel within the home. And then coming over to your closet. Nice closet. I can get in here all the way. And then more of those adjustable shelves. into this would be the master bedroom with the ensuite let's kind of head over here and then i'll let you we'll pan it around it's a very spacious beautiful room with two closets And the bigger closet. Man. We all know who's getting this one. Me. <laughs> all right, and then into the master ensuite. Oh man, it had me. I thought we were about to do Something special. No tub, dang it. Oh well, I'm not gonna dock too many points. This is a very, Ooh, I like those a lot. The kind of double vanity. Ooh, are these? Open up with some medicine cabinets. That's neat. And then just a shower. But it has a bench on either side. So it kind of makes up for it. All right, so again, this is the Frontier by Cozy Homes. This is brand new for 2021. Uh, super exceptional manufacturer. I just want to let you know that uh, they make some beautiful homes. But let's go ahead and uh, let's discuss base price and then tour price. So the base price on this home is $189,000. Uh, and then what you've just seen, how we've toured it, is $218,000. So this manufacturer is a little bit more expensive than some of the other homes that we have been seeing. But I think what they do with the home, you're not gonna find quality like this in most of these other modular and manufacturer homes that we've been looking at. 